Founded in 1922 by Anna Rice Cook, the Honolulu Museum of Art is home to one of the largest single collections of Asian and Pan Pacific art in the U.S. Here now to tell us more about their current and upcoming exhibitions at the museum is curator Hailoha Johnston. Nice to have you on Living 808. Thank, Thank you for you coming for in. Thank you for inviting me. Well, you have a fabulous job and you're doing a wonderful, excellent job of creating new and exciting things. Tell me about the Museum of Art for anyone who hasn't had a chance to come out. Sure. So the Honolulu Museum of Art is located on Baratania Street, right across from Thomas Square. And any day of the week if a visitor comes to the museum, they will see something they had not seen before. In many cases, our uh, permanent collection, which is installed across our 30 galleries, will include casework that is on a constant rotation. So there's always something new that's brought out from our collection. And uh, I would encourage anyone who comes to talk to our VIC specialist at the front to get those pointers. That's when great. they enter the museum. Get the inside scoop. And you have a special, is it a temporary exhibit that's on display right now? So when you visit the Honolulu Museum of Art, our 4,000 square foot gallery right now until July 14th um, features an installation by an artist from Aotearoa named Lisa Rehana. Mm -hmm. The title of her exhibition is Lisa Rehana Emissaries. And the installation is actually riffing on a series of wallpapers that were produced by a French manufacturer in 1804. But our 4,000 our 4, square foot gallery now is filled with sound and movement through Lisa's adaptation of that piece. It's fantastic. It was at the last Art After Dark a chance to get right. in there and it really was to go from both rooms and but to talk to some of your excellent art our, our docents docents okay our I didn't want to get the team of docents. word wrong yes they can fill you in and tell you about that and you can pick up on things that you wouldn't but the movement that we're looking at right now is incredible what's in the wings what's coming up next for the museum we have a lot coming up this summer so opening on July 6 tomorrow night mm -hmm. our Sir film festival it runs throughout the month of July which is really exciting for us always something going on in our Doris Duke Theater. We also have an exhibition on view called 21st Century Women, which features artwork produced within the past 19 years that are part of our permanent collection, uh, featuring works by female artists from all over the world, including Hawaii, which is really exciting. Um, we have one of our uh, incredible exhibitions opening August 24th, featuring work by Li Wai Yi. He's a contemporary artist who does incredible large-scale landscapes. That's, we're really looking forward to that exhibition. We also, up until September, have an exhibition on view by a Hawaii-based artist named Melissa Kimara, and her exhibition titled Migrant features her own kind of interrogation of genealogy as someone who was born and raised here, descended from immigrants, and she kind of unpacks her own genealogical history to participate in contemporary conversations around human migration. Always something new and different there. I just have to ask, as a curator, what is your favorite part of this job? I would say I love connecting people and ideas through art. I love seeing people approach a piece with inquiry and uh, discover something new in an artwork or see the world differently than they had before they'd actually sat down to kind of think through the work with the artist. Oh, that's fantastic. And there's something that will really just pique people's curiosity and make them think in different ways, too. What is the website so people can look at your full calendar of events? If you go to the Honolulu Museum of Art.org, you will find um, an events page and a calendar for everything happening at our theater. We have lectures, workshops, and just on an ongoing basis, we've got an incredible cafe, we've got a coffee bar, and a museum shop where I got this necklace. I was noticing that. We're going to have to get a close-up <laughs> to see that necklace. It's beautiful. Do you know who made that? As you no, I'm, it's not a local artist, okay, it's beautiful. Um, but a lot of our uh, pieces in the shop are made by Hawaii-based artists mm -hmm. and featuring artists from around the world as well, um, incredible jewelers, and it's a dangerous place to visit, <laughs> but I would say you have to, you can't, you can't miss it. And to work there, too, yeah. I'm going to be spending my Yeah, we pass the through there, it's a little dangerous, but. Right. Hey, Aloha, thank you so much. We have the information up again about the Museum of Art, open Tuesday to Sunday, become a member, go to Art After Dark, so many ways to explore and enjoy the Honolulu Museum of Art. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me.